classrooms, drop your bath, then move to the devotion ground. Now, oh yeah, have legs, my friend. Run down from there, the last person will get it very hot. I'm, I'm serious. Like I'm dead serious, run down from there. Celebrity students, you guys are big enough to have children. Look at... Ah! Fine auntie, fine auntie, what, what, what? What your side doing? Look at you. What you? You're old enough to have kids. You're deceiving yourself, still in SS2. Fool. Let's go. See you. What? What's your level soon? Come get up, my friend. What's your level soon? Before you now tell me your mother is this or that. Fool. Look at this. How old do you think I am? Fool. Drop your bags and run to the devotion ground now. All of you get out from that classroom. Good morning, students. I'm here. Sorry, ma'am. Two of you should come out and kneel down here. Now. Ma, I cannot stand to have a infection in my leg. Ma, I've been sick for four days now. They, they don't have five days. Days. Okay, five days. Emmanuel and Mimi, if you don't come out and kneel down here, all of you will fail my test. No! no. 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 Who does that? I don't know. No, ma. You can't punish everybody just because of two people. That's then advise them. Advise them before I change my mind. Hello, ma. All of you felt that. Hello, ma. Listen to me. Okay. Because I've not been talking. That's why I think I'm a quiet dog. No, you told me. My mother is a soldier. I want to do a The man will last. Don't stress yourself. I sleep up for me. I will load down with me. Two double hands, man. Sleep up for me. Don't ever try it again. I'm not changing for you. I have nothing to tell you. Messi, see here, for this school, eh? Hands go touch you one day. My hands go touch you. Jesus, let, 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 let me this get the is for. Messi! Okay, you don't know me yet. No problem. Let me you date me, rub my cream. Wait, did you talk? So I go rub cream. Imagine me and you date. If I keep cream, you go rub 
Wait, 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 wait. What are you saying? We are late to meet beauty class. Oh, hey, what's the time? What's the time? Oh, she can, she can. She doesn't. Pass, pass, pass. Please. Oh, she's petty, man. Please. My mouth, you can't go home. Please, put this up, okay? Press on, press on, press on. Please, go now. Oh, you can't go back another one. Please, go, let's go be fast. Don't go, baby. Please, put that drink in the bag. Wait for me now. Wait for me now. What you can say, right? It's either you leave or I do. Yes, ma. Yes. It's me, Emmanuel, Emmy Boy. Ma, in this school, my father paid my school fees in full. Yes, now. Yes, now. So I'm not leaving to anywhere. I will learn. So if anybody wants to leave in this class, ma, I think you should be the one to leave. You are a big fool. I can see you're high on cheap drugs. You better change your plug before you go mad. Leave now or I leave. Ha! <laughs> if you leave now. Okay, it's okay, guys. Already, um, we we're rounding up already, so you're good, right? Okay, see you guys in the next class. Bye bye. Bye bye. bye, -bye. bye. With your picky putty putty. Bye. Let us go. Mimi, come outside. Come and name that. Why should I come and name that? Why? For the last time. Come out and kneel down here. I will come out, but I will not kneel down. I think you, you, you will not know what? You don't be trying that one, no. I don't be trying that. What did you say? My head are right. Yes, oh yes, your head are right. She will not kneel down. And you, you, you can never try. Don't even try to get to flood her. I can see you've gone mad. You've gone nuts. As in, you've lost it. I love it like that. Not even like a doubt. You are a doubt. I love it, Biggie Biggie. I love it. You must be very mad. I see. <laughs> but it, it don't know me. You don't know me. You don't know me. Gregory! Watching. Keep quiet. What's the meaning of this in the class? Miss Beauty. Yes, sir. You say there is something you want to discuss with me. Yes, sir. It's about SS2 students, sir. 
I am tired. I can't continue with them anymore. They don't respect me. Those children are spoiled brats. Miss Beauty, watch your language on my students. I'm sorry, sir. You said you can't continue with them. I can't, sir. Seriously? Yes, sir. I'm sorry to say that. Okay, but um, you would have to stay with them until I can find someone to replace you. Uh, it looks like um, all the teachers are afraid of that class. Not like it appears. They are all tired, sir. Okay. Please bear with me. Stay with them until I can find a replacement for you. I will just try. Honestly, there are something else, sir. Well, okay. I will uh, go and uh, talk with them immediately. Please do. Mm -hmm. I really appreciate it. It's okay. Okay. Thank you. What are we going to do about this? See, just forget about that, that one. I don't know. Let her confess. If, if she stays off our path, then we are not going to give her trouble. But if she wants trouble, I'm going to cha cha cha. You know? Stop that one. Okay. For the benefit of those who were not at the morning position when the principal introduced me, I am Miss Kate, your new literature teacher. I believe you must have gone far with Miss Beauty. Yes, yes, yes. Can anyone tell me what you learned? I was just really talking. Yeah. Let me say it. I'm the most intelligent student in this class. Wow. Yeah, me. Yes. Hey, what is it? No, don't worry about this. this the doctor says should be like this. So, um, ma. I want to tell you what the last teacher talked about. But uh, before then, I, I just have one request. And I know you will grant it. I only want you to pull up your clothes. Hey, man. I shall do your act. Listen to me, young man. You do not try such nonsense in my class. Do not ever repeat such jokes in my class. I don't take it and I will not take it for your punishment. You must write 3,000 words saying I am sorry, I will not repeat it. I never do it. I will never do it. Yes! I can never do it. Impossible. Yes. Okay. Only if you take off your clothes. Yeah. Natural phenomenon. And for your notice, you don't know. You came to the wrong class. This is Hellfire. Welcome to Hellfire. And I am the devil. Prepare to rot there because you will definitely burn to ashes in that fire of yours. You are not welcome here. Go! Listen and listen very attentively. I do not care who your mother is, whether she owns this country or the entire world. If you do not write the 3,000 words saying, I am sorry, I will not repeat it, <laughs> I promise you will be expelled from this school. Uh, actually, Miss Kate, I, I thought you were, you, were, you were playing. I thought you were not serious with all this whole 3,000. Me, not one, not 100, not 200. Fight for 3,000 words. Yes, 
you for insulting me right in your class. I am only being nice, asking you to write just 3,000 words. I could have handed you over to the police for assault. Yes. I think that is a good way to start, just to correct the wrong foot of your life. Okay, introduction time. I'm very, very sorry I did not introduce myself. You know, you are a new teacher, you just came new, so you think uh, you can take over. I'm Emmanuel by name, aka Emmy Boy. Emmy Baba, I'll give me. Emmy Baba. See, listen to me, Miss Kate, you cannot come to this school and then you think you can take over everything. Ask about me, or ask my classmates, ask the principal, ask the school. I can never, and I will never apologize to anyone. And it will not be you. I demand you do exactly like I said. Else, you will not like my action. Bring the game on. Bring the game on. I am ready, ma. Mrs. Teacher, teacher, I am ready. Bring the game on. And listen to me, this job you think you have, you are bragging with. Little salary they pay, you can just take it off. Oh, Shut up. Hey. I have heard about you and your crew. But you know what? I am prepared for you. Better be prepared, you. It's not when I start, it's not. Ta, 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 you're wrong. Better be prepared. You are talking to Emmanuel anyhow. You don't know me. You don't know me yet. Better be prepared, you be prepared. Be prepared! Some group of lunatics locked me up in the office. So this punishment serves as a warning to all of you. So no one try such with me again. Remember, I keep telling you, none of you is too small to sleep in the police cell. So watch it. Anyway. I have decided to give you mass failure on the test I was supposed to give. Try me again and watch me make you repeat the class. Shh! Who does that? Hello. <laughs> what are you saying? I can't really get what you're saying. Okay, just hold on, I'm coming. Let me let me come down. I'm coming. I say it over and over again, and I love you too. <laughs> this Miss Kate, she's doing too much in this school. We have to do something about her. Ooh, we Ms. have to Kate. do something about this woman before she will come and scatter everything for us. If that's that's true too. That's just the truth. Um, for me, I'm tired though. I don't, I don't even know what to do again. If you have an idea, you can bring it out, I'm in. Baby. Yeah, baby. I want you to make her fall in love with you. Hey, what are you saying now? Can you hear yourself speak? To make her fall in love with me? Hey! <laughs> nah, hey, baby, I'm making me laugh. Baby. You know how much I hate that lady? I hate that woman with passion. <laughs> I want you to make her fall in love with you. I'm not saying she fall in love with her. I'm saying she make her fall in love with you. Then when you guys are together, I will come and take pictures with you. You will use it and blackmail her into doing whatever you want her to do in this school. Reason it now, baby. Reason it. Eh? So, do you think that woman will fall for me? Ha, baby. Who will not fall in love with you now? If I can fall in love with you, anybody can fall in love with you. Ah, fine boy. See how handsome you are. Hey, baby, reason now. We have to do this thing before that woman will come and make us repeat classes. So, oh. ah, please now. Hey, baby. Ah. Mm. 
Trust this thing. I know this game. Trust your game now. Eh? She'll fall in love. Don't worry. What I do not understand is how I was being locked inside the office. But how sure are you that they're the ones that locked you up? Who else? It is so obvious, sir. Was that why you failed them so woefully that you blandly refused to give them a chance to rewrite their exam? Was that? It is for their punishment, sir. Mm. Failure to do so attracts massive punishments. Miss <laughs> okay. Kate, I have been meaning to ask you this. Yeah. What did you do to assess two students that they obey you this much? As in, there is no teacher that has ever stayed with them for two months without quitting. Well, there is no secret. I have dealt with worst people. So I see them as children. Those guys are not children. Tell me the truth. Honestly, I, want, I just want to know. It's nothing. Down. Um, okay, you just have to learn the techniques on how to handle children. Let's say um, child psychology, that's the secret. There you go. <laughs> <laughs> Man, those guys are not children. They are thousands. Um, Miss Beauty, sorry, I, I have class work to mark, okay? See you later. Sure, are you that this plan is going to work? Babe, there's no harm in trying. Imago can do something all of us never expected. Calm down, it will work. In that case, let's see how it goes. Because for me, I don't want to be in this. Babe, we go. Trust me, I said it's going to work. Let's go. Calm down. Did you see the way Mana was running into the staff office with the food he bought? I also saw him from the classroom window. I was like, who is after him? Never knew those running was for Miss Kate. Oh. Miss Kate? Guy, along with that, imagine, I could have been to the thing, oh. <laughs> Guy, that kind of love you happen. Imagine I'm a teacher and student. Which kind of love you that one? More the collaboration, no more than Guy, that bad guy. <sighs> This is totally out of plan. This is not what we planned for. I said, make her fall in love with you. But it's like you're falling for her. Why are you being so nice to her now? You're always at her beck and call, always following her everywhere, always carrying her books. Miracle, see, listen up. You are the same person that brought her this plan. Yes. The truth about this thing is just that you are jealous. You brought her this plan. How do you expect me to make a lady fall, fall for me if I, if I, you know, do not play nice with her? I need to play nice to her. This, we, are, we are acting, you know, this is just a stage. Don't you understand it? You brought her this plan. But you want me to stop? If you want me to stop, you say it. I, I never say so. But stop making me feel jealous. You've been too, too, too nice to her. You're overdoing it. It's like you're enjoying the whole show. Can you stop? Can, can you stop this thing? Please, stop. 
The man is falling on our plan. Eh? We sent her to go and fall, uh, make that woman fall in love with him. Now he's falling in love with that woman. <laughs> See the way he's always running after her. Emma is really messing up, I swear. Um, in that case, we have to do something. Like what? Um, something like going after her, then teach her some lessons. You know, I think that that would be for us. I am not listening. What do we do? <sighs> I was told that you fell down while coming out of the office. Yes, sir. Are you alright now? Yes, sir. Thank you very much. Oh. Have you had some medication? I have had that, sir. You had medication? Yes, sir. Okay. Alright, I'm sorry for everything. Thank you, sir. I pray that it doesn't repeat itself again. Okay, I just called to find out you can leave. Thank you for the concern, sir. of speech we learned. Drop that phone! How can you be pressing phone in my class? Give them to me. Give the phones to me. Are you okay? So I said, who can tell us the figures of speech? Okay? Uh, metaphor. Metaphor. Correct. Clap up for me. Wonderful. That means you are learning. So who can tell us what specification means? <laughs> okay. Irony. Irony. Yes. Correct. Irony. Personification. Personification. So who can tell us what specification means? Okay, ma'am. Personification is actually used to describe or give meaning to a non-living being. And personification comes from the word person. Person, that is using inanimate objects as, addressing them as animate exactly. objects. Yeah. Clap your hands. Okay, who can give us, we learned other things like simile, metaphor, irony, when you mean the opposite of what you are actually talking about. Hyperbole, exaggerative statements. Please let us not learn to forget. Go and write the figures of speech we have with examples each. Bring it to the staff room. Emma, ensure you collect all of them. Classwork, not homework this time. Classwork, write down the figures of speech. With make two sentences each for simile matter for all of them. No, 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 I've not seen it. You've not seen it? No. Uh, any problems? No, no. Are you sure? No. Jimmy, what is it? Why are you looking worried? Is everything okay? 
I'm looking for him, ma. Have you seen him? No, I have not seen him. Is he not in class? No, I've been looking for him everywhere. Ah, calm down, ma. Is that why you're looking so stressed? Come, let's go. Like she owns the school. <laughs> we will deal with her, she's leaving the school. <laughs> but uh, I'm wondering why Emma is behaving like this. Uh, it's making me sad. Don't worry, dear. You know Emma is my guy. Don't worry, I will talk to him. Leave that to talk me. Talk to him. Yeah, I will talk uh -uh. to him. Emma is just going off the plan. Uh -uh. Like you don't have manners. Do they read love letter with two people? Take a chill pillow, have a seat. Okay, then just me. Just you what? I'm a boy. Just you what? You are doing more than yourself. Okay, let me know who this girl is falling for. Come on. What is this? <laughs> you will tell me this girl. Stop it, stop it, stop it. Did you notice the sudden change of Emma? Oh, yes, I did. You did? Yeah, I did. But it seems he's very serious with his studies right now. And he now runs very far away from us. I, I don't know what that so-called mistake has given to him that makes him to run away from our plan. The plan that we had with him. See, uh, the fact is that he's 
You go. You are fine. Let's go. Let's go. <laughs> Why do you think you're hmm? You should be ashamed of yourself for messing up with your own students. I shall be acting almighty. Acting as if she's a no nonsense person. <laughs> Not knowing that she likes eating young, fresh meat. Leave my man alone. Else, you face the consequences. See, this is the picture I took of both of you. Have you seen? If you don't leave my man alone, I am going to post it on all social media and even send it to his mom. And hey, if you do not want to lose your job, <laughs> you better stay away from Emmanuel. Excuse me. A word is enough for the wise. And if you're wise, you will stay away from my man. <laughs> Hello, Miss Kate. I've been calling you. Why are you treating me like this? Answer me now. Please, give me a listening ear. Leave me alone. This year, I don't like this thing you are doing. Please tell me, what have I done wrong? Just tell me. Let me know so that if it's not... Leave me alone! What have I done now? What have... Emmanuel, when next you come close to me, I will put you for a last night. Stay with me. Miss Kate. Yes, sir. Good afternoon, sir. Leave whatever you are doing and follow me immediately. Sir, I hope everything is okay. Do as I say. All right. Sir. Miss Kate, what is the meaning of this? I mean, what explanation will you give for this? You are having an affair with a student in this school? Take a look. Sir. Sir, please, this is not true. It is not. It's not true. Really? Miss Kate, I'm thoroughly disappointed in you. Very, very disappointed in you. I was happy at least I have one teacher that the students fear and respect, but not anymore. Do you know this can cost you your teaching career? Sir, I am sorry. I have nothing to do with him. He's the one always coming after me. Eh? Mm -hmm. Why didn't he come after me too? Oh, because you're more beautiful than me or something. Miss Kate. Yes, sir. <sighs> I will not want to be the one to send you out of your career. No. You must reverse yourself. You must call yourself to order. You must reassess yourself. What you're doing is dangerous. If the school's board hear of this, it won't be easy for you. Get out of my office and be of good behavior. Thank you, sir. So I am here thinking I was the, the problem. 
like with my usual complaints. Hardly did I know you were secretly exploiting them sexually. Listen, I am not in the mood for your nonsense this afternoon. What's your problem? Now I get the point. The flower, the notes you were reading, was sent by him. Can you imagine? You irritate me. Ah. And you say, saying, God, when? God, when? Oh, oh, oh. What's your problem? Can you leave me alone? Excuse me. What am I doing? Why do you irritate me like you? As, as in, as then go to hell. Oh, gosh. Ah. How could you? If it affects you that much, madam, go and die. You think? You don't try it with me, I swear. You don't try it. Thank you, stars. What do you want? <laughs> so you thought my ma loves you. I was the one that sent him to come and seduce you. So that we can take advantage of that and be doing as we like in class. To avoid getting into trouble with me. Stay away from my man. Stay away from my man. Tell me what Mimi said is not true. Mimi? What? What did she say? That all this was just a plan to make a fall for you. Not that you loved me. Yes, but... But what? Tell me. I fell in love with you. <sighs> As it was. You expect me to believe that? Yes, you, you have to believe me because I'm saying the truth. Emma, I believed you. I was willing to give up my job for the sake of love. Not knowing I was played. What you are saying is not true. I can never play you. I, I, I did not play you. I, I, I fell in love with you. You made me a better person. That's just the truth. You changed, you changed everything about me. And I love you. Please. Please, don't do this to me. Whatever that is running through your heart, don't, don't, don't do it. Forget about everything Miracle was saying. Is, I love you so Don't much. you ever touch. No, come close to me. Henceforth, we only communicate as teacher and student. Nothing more. No. You can't say this, please. You can't say this, please, ma. Please, my, my love. Why? No. Just think about what you're saying. See what you're saying. I, I love you so much. And I can do anything for you, please. Take your fake love to your girlfriend. You know I love you. Don't, don't everything Miracle was saying is a lie. I love you. Before. You have succeeded, right? Your big plan has finally come to pass. You are happy. Do you actually love her? I thought this was just a game, like we planned. It was a game. But at the long run, love took over. But it's fine. Everything is gone. It's all gone now. 
Let's just not talk about it. Baby, sorry now. Eh? Sorry, I'm sorry. Eh? Sorry. If she doesn't want to, I'm here for you. I'm sorry. Good morning, madams. Um, submit your homework. I am talking, you are talking, I don't get it. Stay away from me. Leave me alone. Allow me to do the job that brought me to the school. When next you come close to me, I'll take legal action for harassment. I'm not avoiding you. I'm only trying to be serious with my studies, which is something you can never understand. Oh, baby. Excuse me. Baby. Forget about this guy. Uh -uh. Because of that whole thing. Mm. You, have you have not. By the time we are done with that lady, he will come back begging. Mm -hmm. Just chill. See, Manuel. As in. <laughs> <laughs> Why are you doing this? Yes, why are you doing this to us? I know it's affecting you too. See what you are doing to me. You're, you're breaking my heart. You know I love you so much. I'm in love with you. Do you want me to lose my job? I can always find a better job for you. Yes, I'll talk to my mom. She'll get you a better job, better than this one. Do you actually know what you're saying? You want to talk to your mom about me? What will you tell her? That you love me and she will accept me? She will accept you. It's my mom we are talking about here. No, my mom. I, 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 look, I, I don't even care about the age difference. I don't care about anything here. What I'm saying is the love. I love you so much. You've made me a better person. You changed me. Look at me. You made me start reading my books. You changed me totally. Please don't do this to me. Please don't do this to me. I, I can't even need that. I can do anything you want. I'm happy you are a changed person. That's because of you. Please don't leave me. Please don't do this again, not again. My love. I love you, I love you, I love you. Madam! Madam! Stay away from my 
boyfriend. Stay away from my boyfriend. You've convinced him to stop talking to me, right? How is he's not talking to you my business? You caused it, so it is your business. You better stay away from me. If not, you will not like my actions. Are you not ashamed of yourself throwing yourself on somebody's boyfriend? Oh. Thank goodness you said boyfriend and not husband. Oh, you're now bold to say that. After snatching my boyfriend, I'm making him feel that he loves you. Why are you contradicting yourself? I thought you said you sent him to seduce me so you all can blackmail me. Did I get that right? If so, why are you worried? Um, anyway, this will teach you a lesson. Never to mess with someone older than you. Meanwhile, the amount of time and energy you put into running after boys, if you invest that same energy or even half of that, he wouldn't be having straight F's. Go and study your paper. that you don't even look at another woman. That is why I sent him to seduce her. <laughs> Let alone falling in love with a, a woman old enough to be his mother. <laughs> I've lost him for good. I only sent him to go and seduce that woman. <laughs> <laughs> but wait to When you see that still in mind, I'm sure you look like more bit Chris more for her head. Jesus Christ. <laughs> What's the point? It will not make him love me back. I'm gonna say it now, me, eh? I'm gonna beat her. I'm gonna make sure she faints. I'm gonna beat her, beat her. I'm gonna press her neck. Mama is safe. Why will you be dating someone that is older than you, old enough to be your mother? What's in the man where they find for this woman? She's just there having a deep breath. She's so crying. I've lost you. <laughs> I'm learning my lesson, I'm not trying to not say this. <laughs> <laughs> 